Okay, today we are going to make boo boo buns. What a boo boo bunny is, it's a little bunny made out of a washcloth that you keep in the freezer. And um, if somebody gets a boo boo, you simply put an ice cube in the boo boo bunny's back and you give it to the child, and voila, no more boo boos. So what you need to do this project is washcloth. I get bundles at Walmart for like $5. They come in white, blue, pink, depending if you have a boy or a girl or who you're making it for will decide your color. You also need some elastics. Any kind of elastic will do. And then you need some eyes. I have two different sizes. I use the tiny ones for toddlers so that if they do happen to bite the eyeball off, there is no choking hazard involved. You also will need ribbon. Um, again, any color that you want to use. This is um, 5 eighths of an inch of ribbon. I also have a thicker ribbon, which is, uh, I'm sorry, this is 5 eighths, and this ribbon that I normally use is 3 sixteenths of an inch. And then you also need a glue gun with a glue stick. If you've never used a glue gun before, be very, very careful. The tip gets very hot, and you can just keep it on a paper plate so that this way, if the glue drips out of the tip, it's not going to ruin any surface that is hot. So what you do is you take a washcloth and you're going to start at a corner and you're just simply going to roll it right to the middle of the washcloth, like so. And then you're going to turn it around and you're going to go to the opposite corner and you're going to roll that part into the center. and it'll look like that. Then you're just going to take it and you're going to fold it right in half and then you're going to turn it to its side and you're going to watch it start to come together. Here's the ears and here's the body and you're just going to fold it over. I just got to turn it this way and then you're going to take an elastic and you're going to wrap it right around the front part and this is the head that you're making now and then you're just going to pull these ears up fix them so he's not discombobulated discombobulated <laughs> said and there's your boo boo bunny now you're going to take a piece of ribbon i have them already cut it's about 17 inches long and you're going to actually, we're going to do a different color. And you're just going to wrap it around where the elastic is. And you're going to tie a bow. It's not rocket science. It doesn't have to be perfect. It's very forgivable. Now he's really coming together. And then we're going to take two eyeballs. here. That'll do ya. One eye, two eyes. These boo-boo bunnies are actually going to Princess and Monkey at Southern Fairy Tales. There you have it, your little boo-boo bun. If you want to get really creative, you could get a little pom-pom and you could put it right here on his backside. I don't like the pom-poms because I just think if a, if a child bites it off, it can get stuck and I'd rather no pom-pom. So then you take this, pop it in the freezer, and you are all set. Every child needs one of these. They're great for baby showers, for Easter baskets. Um, they'll use them from the time they're little up until teenagers. <laughs> My kids still use them. So that's it. Here's your boo-boo bunnies. And good luck and happy crafting.